My name is David Tench. I'm the musical director of The Voice UK. And uh, we're in band rehearsals at the moment. And I'm here to talk about the KSC 1500s for sure. Accurate monitoring is the most important thing for me actually because I have to have my ears open and taking in everything perfectly at all times. So I can't afford any kind of muddiness, I can't afford to hear any pronounced frequency ranges. It all has to be even and clear and fast. People don't normally use them for stage monitoring, but I read what they what people what people said they sounded like. I read people's impressions. And I just thought, this is the kind of thing that I'm looking for. What we're trying to do on The Voice is we take source material from anywhere. So whatever it is, I need to hear it revealed the most accurately I can possibly hear it. So we brought them down and I put them in. Straight away, it's like a veil had been lifted, especially in the top end. Everything was clear, but it's not just about clarity, it's about speed. And it sounds really weird to talk about sound with speed, but everything just is fast and tight with these KSC 1500s. I don't know why that is or how. The only explanation I can think of is it, it's this electrostatic technology, which is available in speakers and other headphones, but it's never been available in this tiny, tiny thing. It's even actually smaller than this, because I've had these little molds put on to sort of improve the, uh, to cut out the outside sound, basically. Um, but they're even smaller than this normally. So how sure I've done it, I don't know. But it, what it does for me is it just opens all the sound out. Um, and it gives me a wide, like a, what seems like a wider frequency range, bottom to top. And also this kind of tightness to the sound. That's all I can describe it as, a tightness, a speed. And like, a, for example, an upright bass that kind of clank of the strings, the huge strings on an upright bass, the way they clank against the fretboard, that it, it happens so fast and it has its own place in the sound. That, for me, as MD of the voice, is absolutely brilliant because it means that I can, I can hear that, I can compartmentalise it, I can put it somewhere and then my ears can focus on something else. So it makes it much easier for me. When I'm on, on the gig, I'm listening to the band, uh, the singer, but I've also got the gallery in my ear. So I've got the producers upstairs calling the shots and they're going camera one, we want to move to camera four, give me this shot. So I have to hear that in case something goes wrong with the show. And what I found was that if I panned them to the right and then I panned all the coaches who were sat in the chairs to the left, it made it easier for me to pick out what's going on. So rather than everything being in one place, and the same thing applies to these. So these do that job for me, but in, an, in a musical way, you know what I mean? Everything's wider, the soundstage is wider, and the speed is such that I, I, can, I can hear things more clearly.